there are still 5.8 billion people who do not have good access to uh, medicine or uh, diagnostic uh, services. To make that happen, you need to really get the cost levels go down, accuracy levels go up, and the patients as well as doctors are expecting a huge increase in productivity. Patients are expecting lower costs. I think that is going to be the final outcome with all these dig digital solutions. Well, I, I think, you know, the big thing that is moving the needle is the precision health. You know, some may call it in different names. The precision health, simply put, is how can you detect a disease quickly? How can you detect disease correctly? You know, if you are able to do that, your treatment can be far, far better. Uh, but it requires a lot of understanding. You know, I'll give you an example of a family doctor used to be very effective because family doctor always knew the history of a patient. And they used to always treat them well because they knew what worked well as a medicine for a patient, what worked well for uh, the pa uh, you know, what worked well for the entire family. So that used to drive a great outcome for that patient and the family. Now, with Precision Health, what we are trying to do is using the data that we are getting from the patient about the disease. We are trying to drive a lot of outcomes with that intelligence that is being built in. Well, we are building big on Precision Health. Uh, for, for us, this is going to define the entire strategy of future healthcare. So what, what we are trying to look at is how do we utilize present strength that we have in terms of clinical expertise, uh, diagnostic ex expertise, and combine this with digital expertise. Uh, we, you know, we, we need to create the future of technology in healthcare where you are going to bring in a lot of experts from the field to come in and collaborate. So the trend is changing in a big way. So unless you look at partnering with a lot of people, startups, uh, like-minded people who are trying to bring in some different views, uh, you will not be able to be reaching the success levels. So healthcare is looking at partnering, collaborating, and driving success through open innovations. Well, I think uh, partnerships, innovations, if they need to succeed, you need to get a lot of people on board. I think the challenge that we used to always face is we always were limiting ourselves to work within our own boundaries. So we are trying to look at getting a lot of startups on board. Uh, we are trying to get uh, partnerships with other companies uh, to br who bring in a lot of acumen in terms of computational uh, capabilities, AI capabilities. We are partnering with universities. Uh, we are partnering with uh, a lot of research institutions. I think these are uh, big things that are going to change the uh, you know, outcome for healthcare industry as well as GE Healthcare.